Why, hello there. Oh, I forgot my music credits. Whoops. <laughs> Why, hello there. Oh, good meowning. Good afternoon or good evening. Whatever time it is for you, thank you so much for joining. Welcome to tonight's stream. Um, we're doing an interesting stream tonight. Um, one that we've never done before. Let me pop over here. So, <laughs> a little bit of backstory about tonight's stream and why, uh, why we're, we're doing this. Um, so, last night, right before bed, um, I watched a, uh, TikTok about, um, uh, raising butterflies and uh, about caterpillars and stuff. And it was like, oh, that's right. I completely forgot that I really like uh, caterpillars. Um, like I like caterpillars. They're really cute. Uh, some of them are really cute. Some of them are really cool. Some of them are really, ooh, <laughs> don't know how I feel about that. Um, but, okay, good, okay, good. <laughs> right window. But most of them are very adorable. Um, and there are a lot of different types of caterpillars. And so I was like, ah, oh, yeah, caterpillars. And I went to bed. Why is my model off to the side? There we go. I went to bed early last night. And then, <laughs> then I woke up, kind of half woke up. I was half asleep. Um, and my brain was like, what if for a stream, I just looked at caterpillars like, that's a weird stream, but I could do it, and it would be fun, and I would enjoy it. Um, so... Hi, Satanica! Hello, Caterpillar stream! Caterpillar rave! Oots, oots. Oh, God. Oh, the model did. Oh, the model glitch. <laughs> um, but yes, so I woke up last night, like, 11 o'clock at night, or so, in half-asleep days, and just tweeted, Caterpillars! What was it? What was it? I tweeted because I looked back when I woke up and I went, "Oh yeah, ooh, <laughs> okay, Prince, <laughs> okay, Prince." What did I tweet? Uh, where is it? Ah, yes. Consider this caterpillars. Can I stream just looking at caterpillars and watching videos of caterpillars? Now back to sleep. Uh, which is exactly what I did. <laughs> Um, so I've been, uh, kind of halfway vibrating in my seat all day today, thinking about caterpillars. Um, cause I like caterpillars. I think they're very, they're very cool. Um, and then today at work was just kind of a hot mess. So I was like, you know what? Caterpillars. Caterpillars. Um, I, uh, have liked caterpillars since I was little. I had a, uh... At one of the uh, human daycares I was at when I was younger, um, out in like the outside play area, um, they had this big tree, like this huge tree. Um, yeah. Um, oh yeah. There's not. I don't run into a lot of caterpillars nowadays, um, but that huge tree just got like every spring. Um, it got these huge, um, like, I don't, the infestations is not the right word for it, <laughs> but, um, it was just like, it was all, it was like tent caterpillars or something. So the whole tree would get covered by these like white webs, um, that would be just full of caterpillars. Um, and we as cruel children, um, enjoyed um trying to break the nets and watch the caterpillars drop no 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 like it was like um i don't know they're like tent caterpillars let me let me see if i can get there tent caterpillars this thing this thing this thing
So, like, I have very vivid memories of playing with, like, these type of caterpillars because I was like, caterpillars! Caterpillars! They're really cool. They're kind of fuzzy. Um, and they are... Yeah, they're 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 very interesting. I uh tried to um and I'm, I'm gonna put this in uh, air quotes raise caterpillars in the same way that I tried to air quotes again rescue ladybugs. <laughs> um and uh, as a child I was very fascinated with animal husbandry. I wasn't good at any of it. They all died. Um but uh, I was, I was de bound and determined to get some whatever the hell to these turned into. Never, never got that far. <laughs> so, uh, looking around to seeing like what resources I can get. Yeah. Um. Well, they're not when they're not when you're trying to take care of them in um in a plastic water bottle. And, uh, with a stick and some dirt. I really wasn't, like... The animal husbandry gene didn't come- didn't come in my- didn't come into me. I, um, <laughs> just kind of <laughs> probably, unfortunately, uh, cruelly killed them with ignorance of not knowing how to take care of them. Uh, plus, my Earth Mom hated them. My Earth Mom was like, no, you can't keep those. No, you can't keep those. I was like, but it'll be fun. Um, it was, uh, it was, it was really not fun. <laughs> well, this is also, I was also the kid who built, I tried to build like, build like a whole contraption of like, not gladiatorial cages, but that's the only thing I can think of how to describe it. Like hamster cage stuff, like all the, the, the tubes and stuff. Um, I tried to con um, construct that out of like paper towels, rolls, and cardboard boxes um, for geckos. Like the geckos that I got that like were by our house. Just like tiny little geckos. I managed to get one inside, and then he disappeared. And I, and I was like, uh-oh. Uh, shit, where'd he go? Um, and my Earth Mom was deathly afraid of geckos. It was like, what the fuck did you do? And I was like, uh, geckos! In a cage! See the geckos! My mom was like, nah. 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 But, um, yeah, I had some interesting ideas for animal husbandry. <laughs> um, uh, but so, yes, so here I have the butterflies and moths of North America. <laughs> See, I had a cat! <laughs> I had a cat. Um, with the caterpillars, we did not have the cat. So I think that was partially... That and me talking about wanting a cat was probably why my Earth parents were like, Okay, get the damn child a cat. <laughs> so he stops trying to raise frogs and <laughs> caterpillars. Um, but uh, the, lady, the ladybug rehabilitation project that failed. Um, and the gecko gladiator, you know, tunnel system. That was when I had the cat. <laughs> so I eventually just decided that trying to raise wild animals just really wasn't for me. Um, and <laughs> that, that, that was a phase. <laughs> but I still really like caterpillars, so um, butterflies and moths of North America. They have an image gallery that you can sort. Take me to the image gallery. I would like only caterpillars. We can look at all the caterpillars of North America. <laughs> oh, I don't think Kiki would like that. I think Kiki would be like, Mom, what the hell?
<laughs> See, I could do that. I could. I just don't know where or... Oh, oh! Look at it! It's so scrunkly! <laughs> You're scrunkly! Oh my god! Also very small! A small baby! I cannot have my jacket on right now, it's too warm. Ironic, considering it's like very cold outside. No, I didn't make up scrungly. It's one of the few internet uh, slang terms that I know. It's like, there's like, it's like, people look at me and say, oh, the scrungly. People look at you and say, oh, you ugly. I don't know, it's a weird like, term of endearment. Scrungly. All caterpillars are scrungly now that I think about it. <laughs> Sir! He's wearing a very warm coat. He looks like he's wearing a very nice warm coat. And it just doesn't cover his head. Oh, there he is in another light. Sir, please, your head is gonna get cold. I can't see it. I can't see it. It's too tiny. It's itty bitty. Ah! Oh, okay. Much, much larger now. Oh, yes. I think I should put up an automatic, like, warning bugs. Like, I think that should be obvious, but warning bugs. Up close bugs. If you don't like bugs, sorry. <laughs> Whoa, he fat. He fat. Fat and snuggly in his sweater. Fat and snuggly in his sweater. I've had a day today and I am just gonna be fucking loose and fancy free. And... <laughs> huh? <laughs> Is this the head? I think it's the head. <laughs> You're a little odd, my dude. Oh, you know what I just realized? I can make it this. That is a very straight caterpillar. It's not perfect. Can I? I cannot. Uh, not like that. Eh, it works. Okay. Some of these pictures are also kind of small. Not that one, though. Not this one, though. I think this might just be the same. He's got a very interesting coat. This in Tennessee. Oh, little buddy! Little itty bitty buddy! Ah! Huh. Is this all just the same species, just in, like, different parts of the U.S.? Because, like, this is all just Sweater Man. Sweater Caterpillar. Or maybe that's just, like, a genre of Caterpillar. Sweater. Sir, you're covered in white stuff. Yeah, they, they all are named Todd Stout. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, this one's named Paul. This one's Paul. Very, very interesting. Yeah, this is all... They're all across the... This guy's starting to go into his, um... Go into his sweater. Huh. Oh no, this is a new caterpillar. So I think that is just that was all just one um genus, species, type, 
one type of caterpillar, and now we're on a different caterpillar. Still the same genre, still the sweater genre. Oh, it's kind of cute! Look at his little face! Oh, oh he's a fat boy! Fat boy! This is how I talk to my... to the cat. <laughs> This is just pet voice. <laughs> oh, oh, he angry. I don't know why the little red spots look like he's like, Hmm. Yeah, maybe they're sorted by category. Maybe first up is sweater guys, and then we've got, you know, the stripey dudes. And then eventually we'll have the aliens. All right. Oh, he's kind of cute, he's chunky. I love how chunky they get. And like, based on how big these leaves are, like I can tell that they're really focused in on the camera. Like, the caterpillar is not like very large, but when they get chunky, they kind of chunky. Oh, this, oh, he's, oh, he tiny. Oh, itty bitty bitty. All right. Oh, oh, wow, this is a big one. 2014, too. Uh, shit, math. Um, oh god, I've done too much math today. Uh. Four plus six plus two. Eight. Eight. It's eight. Yes, eight years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing too much bath today. I want him to do more. Alright. Oh, gotta go over here. Oh! He got red spots. <laughs> uh, but we're still in sweater men. Aww. Oh, I think he's pupating. Another man or a different man? I'm uncertain. This might all just be the same man. Huh. Very interesting. I think this all is just... Aw. He's kind of turning around in the leaves. Oh, where is he? Sir, you've submitted a picture of a leaf. I don't see the caterpillar. He's hidden. Perfectly camouflaged. Maybe I should do like a nature documentary. Not. <laughs> well, I could do a document. Documentary. Documentary. If I could speak. It's not bad enough that I can't tilt my head to the right. <laughs> now I can't speak. Aw, he fuzzy. Ah, uh, okay, sir, your head's a little big there. Yep, I think this is all the same man. Yeah, and you know, we can check in a second. He's got a little collar, that's pretty cute. He and I are similar, we got collars. Oh, chunky! I have a really bad crick in my neck right now. <laughs> Like, um, really bad. Um, and have for the past week or so. Um, so it hurts a little bit to turn my head to the right at certain angles. I've been sitting under the, we have a fun little massage, like neck massager, um, uh, at work. And I've been sitting under it for a while. As this one's just gonna have to be like, I'm gonna have to put a hot pad, heating pad on my neck. Yeah. Um, but I also have been head down in a lot of taxes. Oh, he's cute. Ah, yes. So here are the uh, types of caterpillars. So this one was a mangrove skipper, man. Now we have a lot of silver-spotted skippers, as I thought. 
This little buddy was a two-bared flasher. <laughs> Sir? Um, a golden banded skipper. A northern cloudy wing. That a western cloudy wing. Man. Yeah, another American cutscene skipper. But, um, tsh. You know what? You know what, Satetica? That gets... <laughs> I can redeem them too. Alright. Hayhurst's scallop wing. And then the Arizona powdered skipper. Oh, no wonder he looked like he had white stuff all over him, because he was. Oh, the dreamy dusk wing. And the Rocky Mountain dusk wing. Oh yeah, these are all kind of the same family-ish. I think it's family and then species. No, it's species and then genus, I believe. Uh, I don't remember <laughs> my poor biology class. All right, and we have lots of different dusk wings. Oh, the grizzled skipper. <gasps> the two-banded checkered skipper. A small checkered skipper. Oh, they're super tiny, that's why. Gotcha. Yes, yeah, so it is genus that species. So they're for, they're the genus Pygris, Pyrgus, and the species communis. The common checkered skipper. <gasps> Northern white skipper. The common sooty wing. <laughs> ah, I thought you just key smashed there for a second. <laughs> you know what? Mood. Mood. Mohab Sooty Wing. Ah, ha. Uh -huh. So these are sorted by something. Oh, he's got like a bike helmet. He's got a little bike helmet. Oh, his head be tiny. Oh. got a little, like, glass head. I love him! He's also very straight. Very cute. Very cute! Wow! He purple! He's purple! Yeah, they look really long. I want... World record longest Caterpillar. What is the world record longest caterpillar? I don't... Why am I getting cats? <laughs> um... This is a cat. This is a cat, Zetetica. <laughs> yeah, it's a cat. <laughs> it's a Maine Coon. I want caterpillar. Is there a world record longest caterpillar? I'm sorry. That's not real. I'm sorry. There's no way that there's a caterpillar that's 341 meters long. I'm sorry. That's not true. <laughs> All right, Stephen Nicholas of Fisher, German. I okay, I'm confused. He, from Conkers was also on hand as a specialist witness to confirm that the caterpillar was made entirely from chestnut seeds. That's not a caterpillar! Like, that's just not a caterpillar! You lied!
to me! You lied to me! Alright, well, I'm pissed at that. Bye, right, we'll look at other caterpillars. Oh! He's got a little big head. It was just... Chestnuts! Stacked! Against each other! To be long! Not a caterpillar. <sighs> the things people will do to get a world record. Oh, he's got a collar again. We're still in the sweater bed. Oh, cutie pee. Oh, it's cute. It's cute. Look at it! Can't you just hear it saying, Pick me up, please! Pick me up, please! <laughs> it's cute! That's a good question. Can I zoom in on its head? I think I can. If I do, it's, is it, it's control plus. Shift plus? I used to be able to do this. Control plus. There we go. There we go. Look at him. He's like, oh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Are you doing nefarious things, Zatenica? Nefarious things with a zoomed in picture of a caterpillar? Big boy. He's a big boy. He's a big boy. Oh. It more. Whoa! <laughs> wait, wait, wait! You're not supposed to. You're not supposed to agree with me. <laughs> big boy. More sweater boys. From Florida. He's blue and he's from Florida. What are you? You're a Delaware skipper, but you're in Florida. Are you lost, sir? Are you lost? Delaware is up. Up and to the right. If you're in Florida, you're not in Delaware. Lots of skippers. Oh, he's, he's called a Juba skipper. That's adorable. Yeah, he is weird. He is kind of another sweater boy. He's got two little uh, crescent moons on his butt, which I find adorable. Like, I don't know, something about the texture of caterpillars. Like, they look texture, and I would like to touch them. Oh, and we're back to brown boys. <gasps> the world's longest caterpillar. He's got the world record. From Delaware to Florida. One long ass caterpillar. <laughs> Mountains to scale. <laughs> I love these artistic shots. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately. Cool caterpillar textures also come with really cool neurotoxins. Like, man. That's that's one way to um, have some fun. Also, how was the audio levels? Because I think I accidentally turned it up. <laughs> Nothing like caterpillars where there are chill beats in the background.
Aww. He looks- I mean, I know his eyes are on opposite sides of his head. He kind of looks a little wall-eyed. <laughs> Precious little thing. Also, a lot more sweaters. Right now, we're just in genre sweaters. I wonder if I could, like, pitch that to the bug scientists. Be like, have you considered uh, organizing caterpillars in genres? Ah. <laughs> Fun, fun, fun. I, I'm not an MMO person. I, I, I got a. Okay, so this is gonna sound really funny. I got assigned to play WoW. Um, in class. I didn't play it, cause I'm not. I'm not a big MMO person, and I was like, I don't think my professor will know the difference if I play WoW. Or watch a video on, like, WoW for Beginners. So I watched a video on WoW for Beginners, and, um... <laughs> she couldn't tell the difference. <laughs> I felt bad, but, uh, also not. Well, that's what happens when your, uh, when your class is called Intro to Game Design. <laughs> I also- I, I, brought, I got to write a paper on Kirby's Epic Yarn. That was great. Kirby's Epic Yarn and uh, WarioWare. Those were the two games I chose to write my paper on. All about design choices. He kind of gra he kind of gray and brown is dicky. Oh, look at him! Hello, little caterpillar. Oh, look at him! Whoa! Look at his head. He, his head looks like Crest Toothpaste. <laughs> I'm gonna name you Crest. Alright. <laughs> Do I get- Oh, no more Toothpaste head? Where are you? What is- What are you? A, oh, he's a Dun Skipper. Oh, okay. Maybe he's just- Cause you're also a Dun Skipper. Huh, maybe just that one. Had the toothpaste head. I bet he grew into a beautiful minty moth. Yeah, they are kind of like toothpaste. Just... Oh! Oh, it's the little... It's the little clear body blackhead dude. Yeah, green minty toothpaste. Don't eat them, though. <laughs> I feel like that goes without saying, but... But everyone, y'all, please don't eat the caterpillars. I- oh, I was reading, um, I was reading, like, a caterpillar husbandry, uh, someone wrote a little article about it, I was reading it, um, and it was talking about, um, caterpillars are really susceptible to disease, like, really susceptible, um, and, um, like, they get fungus, parasites, viruses, um, bacteria, um, and it was talking about, like, you know, the survival rate. <laughs> True. True. Um, but the survival rate for infected caterpillars is, like, almost 0%. Because apparently bugs have, like, no immune system. Which I find interesting. Um, and so it was talking about, you know, if you have a caterpillar that's infected, um, the likelihood of it surviving is, like, really low. Um, and the longer it lives, the more other caterpillars it will infect. Um, so you gotta do a mercy killing. Um, and I kind of had to pause as I read that. And then it said, you know, the most humane way to mercy kill a caterpillar is to freeze it to death. You know, I mean, I don't have any other options. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with what this guy says. Um, but then he said, then he had the sentence that absolutely like knocked me for another loop, um, which was, you just put them in the freezer. Caterpillar saw in your freezer. 
<laughs> yeah, but his next sentence was like the worst cherry. Uh, because he said, you know, uh, whatever you do, please hold back the urge to squish them. Because if you squish them in like where where they're staying with all the other caterpillars, their bodily fluids are infected too. And like, you'll just infect more caterpillars. And I was like, oh god. Oh god. Um So that was um that was a fun read. And so talking about caterpillars and toothpaste and eating cat pillars and that's where my brain went oh he a long boy wow he really fits in with that leaf good job boy good camouflage whoa holy moly whoa whoa he's got like i don't know I know the, um, oh, what's the slug mind controlled by parasite? <laughs> yes, it's this one! Okay. We're gonna watch this National Geographic thing real fast. Give me one second to mute the, uh, the music. Why would I, why would I mute that, Prince? Okay, zombie, zombie snails, we're watching this for a hot second. Yard. What, the body what? Of this amber what? Oh. Oh, there we go. Snail zombies. Snail zombies. Backyard. <laughs> The body of this amber snail has been invaded by leucochloridium worms, turning it into a pulsating snail zombie. <laughs> this is the bizarre result of the microscopic worm's journey from snail to bird and back again. After incubating in the snail, oh. huge numbers of the parasite's larvae invade the snail's eye stalks. The larvae become vividly colored and puff up the usually slender eye stalks to resemble pulsating caterpillars. Since birds like this pied flycatcher can't resist these lures, they pick at them and end up ingesting the parasite at the same time. After all, bird guts are these worms' ideal haven for reproduction. Eventually, the bird eliminates the new worm eggs through defecation, and the snail laps up this poopy, egg-infested snack. No! Yum. And so, the cycle continues. But wait, there are not one, but two fascinating twists to this story. No, what? First, the snail's mind is seemingly controlled by the worms. The infected snail actually crawls into plain <laughs> really view of did. birds as the sun rises, something the snails never do on their own. I shot a flame. It's as if the worms reprogram the snail's brain for their own nefarious purpose. Final fact? Some snails that have been infected actually live longer than those that haven't. I mean, how's that for irony? Huh? Well then. I shot a flame. Um... <laughs> I'm sorry you had to come in on that as I was, uh, well, as we were watching, um, here we go. So we were watching, uh, zombie snails. Educational content. Educational content. Did you ever think you were going to watch a print stream with educational content? Other than my tax stream? <laughs> Ugh. But yeah, this guy's, this little guy's got like a glass sweater on. He's still part of the genre of sweater boys. Um, he's got some very interesting lattice work of stuff. I am okay. I am okay. Happy to be home. Not ready to be back at work tomorrow. 
and um, uh, dealing with taxes. Dealing with taxes. Lots of taxes. In fact, that's what I'll be doing tomorrow. More taxes. Is that a cat? Is that a caterpillar or is that just like a glitch? <laughs> I think it's a caterpillar, but it looks like a glitch. Yeah, I do. Uh, today marks 31 days, 31 days. And um, we uh, wanna get as many people done as possible. And there's still some businesses outstanding that uh, we need to finish up. In fact, uh, that was the unfortunate news that I got today, was that uh, we have to redo, we have to amend uh, one of the returns that we filed yet last year because of uh, something that uh, we found out. And, uh, Mm, a deep breaths, Prince. Deep breaths, Prince. Um, it is. Uh, it is. It is not gonna be fun. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. <sighs> but you know, it is what it is. I'll deal with it. They'll deal with it. It'll be done. And then, um, and then we're gonna charge them because God, this has been hell. <laughs> oh, the business world. Things be rough in the business world. He's in a he's in a in a root in a log. Whoa! This is our first wild one. This is the genre party boys. Like, yeah, he looks like a party boy. He looks like the type that I would, uh, I would see out on a dance floor. Raving. Whoa, they get weirder. Sir? <laughs> yeah, free, free ceiling. The Rocky Martin, Martin, <laughs> Rocky Mountain Parnassian. Well, you're a fun loving boy, aren't you? Wow, you're really, wow. And then this boy, I'm sorry, this boy looks like he has a lot of growths on him. He has a lot of growths on him. A lot of just very bulbous growths. You wanted to see the weird ones, Zetetica. Here they are. <laughs> oh my goodness. And then here he is in the, in the, the goth version. Again. Oh, oh my. Ah. Huh. And then here he is again. Is this a different one or is this still all the pipe vine swallowtail? Wow. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they are a little odd. Now that we're in the party boy section. Oh, we're getting into the stripey boy section. He's a little, he's, he's a hairy boy. So, so far we have sweater boy, party boy, and hairy boy. <laughs> Come on, uh, entomologists. Pick up, pick up my, uh, my caterpillar, my caterpillar sorting genres. A lot easier if you're like, what do you want? And if someone's like, I want to see a party boy. Oh, he's got a little white spot. A white patch. Ooh. And now we're in stripey boys. 
Stripey boys, sweater boys, party boys, and hairy boys. Oh, very pretty. Very cute, very bright green. Oh, he's oh he's in Canada. He's Canadian. What you thinking about? Ooh, pretty more stripy boys. Eh? Oh yeah, 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 it does. Oh! Black Swallowtail. He is... I think he falls more under Harry Boy. Yeah, he is also kind of stripy. But from the little spikes, I think he might qualify as a Harry Boy. Oh, he's He's got little arms. He's got little wicked wiggy wiggy arms. Yep, hello there. Hairy man. Oh my, very hairy. Oh, he's cute. Look at his little face. Look at his little face. Oh. <laughs> yeah. They're dual genre. But look at his cute little face. And he's got the little... He's got the little uh, antenna. I don't... I made the... I made like a motion with my hand and on top of my head, but y'all can't see that. <laughs> y'all can't see that. <laughs> y'all can't see how much I talk with my hands. Oh, another little hairy boy. It is a little out on my end. Oh, And then we're back to pretty stripy boys. There are a lot of black swallowtails. <laughs> These are all the same. Whoa! You're white. <laughs> oh my god, Prince. You can't ask people why they're white. Um, he's a very... He's a predominantly white boy. Well, we've seen mostly predominantly green boys. Oh. Oh! I feel like he's pupating there. No, in incorrect uh, captions. He's not puking. He's pupating. Yes, now you got it. Oh, he crunch! He's got his big chunker legs in the back to walk, and then he's got his little... Yeah, he's, he's, he's pew, yep, pew painting. Oh. More of these boys? Oh, now, oh, we're in a niece swallowtails. What are you? Yeah, he a big boy. I don't know. He's black and pink. I love him. Oh, it doesn't know what to do now that I've brushed my mouse over it like 20 times. <laughs> yeah, now we're just in more stripey boys. Stripey boys, hairy boys, lots and lots of boys. <laughs> It. Look! This is the Indra Swallowtail. He's very cute. He's got a color blocked uh, sweater. <laughs> little, little orange dots and his little wavy colors. Caterpillars are really cool. I like caterpillars. In case that wasn't 
exceedingly obvious by the fact that I'm literally having a stream just looking at caterpillars. <laughs> What's up, phone? Nothing I need to worry about. These are all just more intra swallowtail, man. Someone literally was just like, how? Oh! Ontario. Eastern Tiger Swallowtail. He's a new little buddy. He's a new buddy. Oh! <gasps> Look how cute he is! Look how cute he is! Oh! Oh! Look at his little face! His little face in his sweater! With his little, his little, uh, hood and his horns. <laughs> oh, perfect little baby. <laughs> Hello, bear. Hello, bear. What's up? Hi. What can I do for you? <laughs> That's just the eyes emoji. Ooh, just eyes emoji. I don't know what I'm looking at either. I think it might be its butt. Ah! Or it might be the front. So like, see these little things on the top? That might be this. I think it's the front. I think it's the front. It's just a brown one. And here he's green. His little cutesy little feet! His little feet! Yeah! He recognizes royalty. <laughs> well, that's like everyone in the freaking pole. Just about everybody say little brother. And I'm like, yeah. I'm a little brother. But, I'm still royalty. Still royalty. Oh, I love him. I love him. These are perfect. I love these pictures so much. Uh, it was little brother, mom figure, or big brother, or other. Um, mom got one vote, big brother got one vote. It's still currently going, but... Let me see, what, what was it currently at? Because I was interested in seeing what people thought I fell into. Where is it? Where is it? Okay, yeah. So, yeah, mother figure got one vote. Big brother figure got one vote. Um, little brother figure got half of the votes. And then other got one vote. So most people agree. I'm a little brother. Okay, so we can't confirm that that thing we saw before was his head. Because here's his head again. Oh, they look like snakes to scare off predators. Ah, oh, Very smart, you little caterpillars. Oh my gosh, I love them. And them in their little sweaters. Oh, he's starting to pupate, I think. Oh. Oh, wow, that was a little bitty one. Look how small it is in relation to that leaf. Oh, that was a little squinty. Oh, no, that's just me guessing. <laughs> Saying they're about to pupate, that's just me guessing. <laughs> me going, hmm, he's positioned himself on the leaf. Hmm, probably pupating. <laughs> Caterpillar expert Prince here saying, probably pupating. 
He's a little squinty baby. Oh, and here's a squinty brown one. Or maybe the same one. I don't know. Oh, squinty. They're just squinty. I love them. Oh, he's orange. He's orange. That's new. Ah, pale swallowtail. Two tailed swallowtail. Interesting. Whoa! He's got little horns. Are you a little devil? My dude. <laughs> He's a little flat. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of reading it down from the back a little bit. A swallowtail? Oh! Precious! He's precious! Oh my gosh! I love him. Like, that's the type that you just want to pet. Like, bug dogs. These are bug dogs. <gasps> He's a banana! He's banana. Oh. Very adorable. Ah! Coming from my heart with these bug dogs. Very adorable. Oh, very adorable. Please tell me, I think, yes, I believe that's the head. I was like, please don't tell me I'm calling the butt adorable. <laughs> it is very banana. It's very banana. Like, like you would expect to pull that out of like a bush. A banana bush. Or like a pepper. Like a yellow pepper. A banana pepper. But he's very yellow. Like very yellow. We've seen some yellowy ones, but not one that's all yellow. Yes, it also is blank white. So he very much pops. <laughs> His camouflage is not doing him good. Yeah, he might be a captive one. He might be a captive baby. Oh, <laughs> Flat. Oh, oh, here he is! Here's a banana on a leaf! Banana on a leaf. Banana on a leaf. Hey there, Mr. Ow. Oh, ow. I, mm, ah, <laughs> I grooved too hard and twinged my neck. All right, well, he's also got, like, blue spots on his butt, which is cool. Got some very cool spots, my dude. Oh, here's one on some bricks. <laughs> now, so now we have, now we have sterile white background, leaves, and bricks. Amazing. Giant swallowtail, whoa. Oh, 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 oh my. Um, all right, this is a party, dude. This is a party man. Look, look at him. He looks like someone got a hold of the paint and like a Q-tip and just went buck wild. That's a very complicated looking caterpillar. What are you meant to camouflage against? That's just a stick. Like, that's just a stick. <laughs> oh, here he is up close again. Maybe he is meant to look like a stick from far away, but it, like, really doesn't match up close. Oh, he's in Quebec. He's Quebecois. Hey there, party man. Yeah, I guess he kind of looks stickish. Oh, oh, we are, we're, we've left the swallowtail family. We've left the the buddies that look like dudes, and now we're back to thin green toothpaste. Oh, 
And so, so there's our other genre. Now we have... <laughs> I, I'm having trouble keeping this running count of genres. We have toothpaste boys, sweater boys, um, hairy boys, party boys, dog boys. Oh my. Whoop, just someone just... Oh, and stripey boys. I almost forgot about stripey boys. <laughs> yeah, tag yourself. <laughs> I can't say. I don't know what boy I would be. Probably sweater boy. I might be sweater boy. I want to be cozy. I want to be cozy. Oh my gosh. Ah! Little toothpaste blob of a boy. Desert orange tip. Well, it's pretty green right now. Oh, help! Or uh, maybe not. Maybe I don't think that's a help. I think that's a hi. I said help at first, but I changed my decision. Whoa, flat green boy. Very much, very much just toothpaste. Welcome to the toothpaste boy genre. Oh, I don't know. Probably to reach things, like to get other leaves or to get onto other parts of the plant. Oh, he's pretty. He's got a white, a white stripe. He's white striped green toothpaste. Oh. <laughs> True. I don't know if caterpillars have noses. Can caterpillars smell? They can. They can. They can't see very well. Caterpillars can sense touch, taste, smell, sound, and light. Caterpillars can barely see at all. Which only di oh they have simple eyes that only differentiate dark from light, huh? So I guess they smell more than we think they do, or more than I thought they do. If they can't really see the leaves, <laughs> oh, you part caterpillar, Zetetica. Part of the part of the hairy boy genre, caterpillars. All right. Oh, more toothpaste boys. They're really cute. Oh, gray marble is what we're on. Oh. Oh. Well, we've reached the end of the fourth page. We're four pages in on these caterpillars. <laughs> this is a fun chill stream. Just looking at caterpillars. Are we still in? Oh. Dotted boy. Many dots. This toothpaste has something on it. <laughs> I wouldn't I wouldn't use the toothpaste if it had black dots in it. Like black is just not a color that when you see something in the wild, you're like, ah yes, edible. Like usually black, you're like, hmm, not edible. Not edible at all. Flavor crystals. <laughs> like someone put like fun dip crystals in your toothpaste. <laughs> Whoa! More toothpaste boys. More marbles. Ah! A pine white. Look how cute he is! He's a sweater boy! I can't tell. Are those just three caterpillars just kind of bunched up? I think they are. I think that's just three caterpillars bunched up. Huh. Huh. Oh, Stripey boy. 
Wow, very, very, um, uh, just green. <laughs> just more greens. Cabbage white? Well, a lot of these, uh, toothpaste. Ooh, he's a spotty boy. Becker's white. More, more stripey boys. Hmm, I would think he qualifies as a stripey boy. Oh! Oh! Oh, it's adorable and tidy. Oh, it's adorable and tiny. It's tiny. It's so cute. There's something about, like, small things that have very large heads that I find absolutely adorable. Oh, here's the stripies again. Stripies, stripies. Stripies, stripies. Whoa, that's a big picture. Oh my gosh, that's a big picture. Um, that's a really, like, that's also extremely searingly green. If you had any uh, any questions about if this was green or not, we've completely answered them. It's green. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, and then back to the little baby. More toothpaste, boys. Whoa! He's got a racing stripe. He's a professional racer. Yeah, now we're in modern day caterpillardom. Look at him. He's ready. He's like the he's like the car that you paint flames down the side of. A pretty boy. Oh, and then we're back to back to normal. Is this the cal Oh, that's the southern dog face. Okay. Now we're the California dog face. He's kind of got racing. He's got like an undercarriage lights. He's got undercarriage lights. I like it. Oh, hey, big boy. You're a long boy. Me neither. I'm pretty certain this one is starting to pupate as well. He's getting that like C shape. Oh, little, oh, wow, oh, that's, that's very interestingly striped. Very interestingly striped. Oh, it's the Cloudless Sulfur. That's an interesting name. Oh, and another up close picture. Yet another uh, black dotted toothpaste. Very interesting. Oh, there's a spotted banana. <laughs> this is my bananas after I haven't eaten them in a couple days. They're like, well, fuck you. And they just become spotted. <laughs> oh, oh, that's an ant. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. What? I'm confused. What am I looking at here? Is an ant? And then a caterpillar. Another yellow boy. He's just toothpaste. Hey there, toothpaste boy. <laughs> oh, he's small. Yeah, he, that really one, that one really did look kind of poisonous. Look how small he is compared to the fingers. Precious. Whoa! That's a cool one. Oh, so that's the large orange sulfur. That was the large orange sulfur. This is the orange barred sulfur. Very interesting. The like... 
of uh, black. Oh, and we're back to toothpaste. 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 Fuzzy toothpaste. More fuzzy toothpaste. Wow, very fuzzy. Ah! I love these little guys. Like, I mean, it, it, I think it's pretty obvious my favorite type is the, like, tiny itty bitty ones with the black heads. Oh my. This just looks like a dust bunny. <laughs> I know it's a, like, harvester. It's a harvester. This just looks like a dust bunny. This is a hairy boy. And this is a chonker. This is a chunky... Uh... Toothpaste. Oh, he's a little hairy, too. Aw. Aw. Such a chunky boy. Whoa. This one is a party boy. This is like raspberry ripple ice cream. It's very red, or, you know, pinkish. Very interesting. And then this one is mostly white with the raspberry. Very interestingly colored. And this one is mostly raspberry. All the different colors. I thought that said Colorado hair steak for a second. And I was very confused about why the steak was made out of hair. But it's hair streak. This is just a flat boy. Flat toothpaste boy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it does. Like latte. Whoa! He's a fire truck. This is the Atala. Amazing. <gasps> this looks like a painting. This looks like someone like went wild with the fur brush. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's adorable. The little furs make it look like he's glowing. It really is. Like, I know it probably stings a little bit. Oh, and he's tiny over here. This is the great purple hair streak. <laughs> oh! <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's tiny! And then it gets bigger. Oh, this oh, this is Cheryl Sheridan's green hair streak. And some more just flat boys. I'm sorry, he looks a little globular. <laughs> it's like someone just went, alright, here's some bubbles. I'm just gonna make a caterpillar. <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, and then the itty bitty ones. Oh, that guy, like, really blends in. Great camouflage, my dude. Great camouflage. This is a juniper. Airstreak. Oh, He's braided! <gasps> and pink! Oh, these are bumpy boys. Oh, 
I know I'm just saying aw a bunch of times, but they're really cute. <laughs> that ant's like, hey, what, what the hell's up with this leaf? Oh my goodness. Whoa, that's like a marble. I'm sorry, who marbled that, uh, who marbled that caterpillar? And then this one's white. And this one's like grayish, green, reddish. And this one's white and pink. We've got the raspberry ripple again. Oh, <laughs> then more of these just pink and green, white. Oh, we've got a new boy, Western tailed blue. This is a, a sweater boy. Amazing. Whoa! Now we've got more raspberry ripple caterpillars than this cutie, this cutie patootie. Whoa! 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 Raspberry ripple! Raspberry ripple caterpillar! Aww. Oh, oh! No, ants, leave him alone. Uh, no. So some some of these are so that's a western tail blue. These are echo azures. The other ones were, yeah. So this is pale dotted blue, greenish blue. <laughs> so they're all. There's quite a few of them that are the raspberry ripple colors, but they're not all the same species, I, interestingly enough. I almost said ironically enough. That's not ironic. It's just interesting. He's a white boy. <laughs> yeah, they, they really did. I think they might have named them after the butterfly. I wonder if the butterfly is blue. Ants! No! Leave the... Leave the poor baby alone! But when you see them in, like, in comparison to ants, you're like, wow. Small. Little baby. Oh, little yellow baby. Oh, interesting. Raspberry ripple. It's another raspberry ripple baby. They blend in, like, really well. I mean, of course they do. Camouflage. They've had years, <laughs> not just years, you know, centuries to perfect this. Millennia, even. Oh, ho, 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 little one. Little baby. Oh, so cute. Oh, kind of segmented here. And then more little babies. More little babies. He's green and pink. Very interesting. Another white little boy. Kind of greenish whitish. A white one. And then the, the the mother of all hairy boys. Look at this hair. He looks like a bunch of dandelion seeds. Um, taped together. <laughs> like, look how fluffy he looks. He's so fluffy. What are you, sir? You're a rights metal mark. Yeah, truly, sir. Sir! And then this little boy! This is a red bordered pixie. <laughs> Welcome to the Harry Boys. Wait, where, where was that from? 
Hidalgo County, Texas. He's purple! He's purple. What if it was purple? Oh, and then more good green boys. And then a Melissa. Oh, wait, no. Oh, Melissa blue also includes a Carter blue. Interesting. Oh, and then we're on to the Monarch butterfly. These are fairly big boys. Many stripey boys. Many stripey big boys. Oh, look at him! He's chewing on some plant matter. They're kind of zebra y. <laughs> oh, he's starting to pupate. Look at him go. And then. Little. Oh, these are. Oh, these are called queen now. Now we've passed the monarchs. These are called queen. Whoa! Ah, yes, you're not milkweed. These are. That's a. That's a big boy. Ah, so they're the same genus, just... Yeah, oh yeah, they're one of those, like, only eat one type, the monophages, or whatever they're called. Another queen. Ah, oh, big boy. That doesn't look like a real animal. <laughs> that thing doesn't look real. I'm sorry, this gulf fritillary? <laughs> I don't know. Is there a prince caterpillar? Let's look it up. I know there's the emperor caterpillar. Prince caterpillar. Oh, yeah, my own tweets. Oh. <laughs> well, um, when you look up prince caterpillar, there's a BL game. Or there's a, you know, yaoi game about it. I feel like that's on brand. That's on brand. Oh, princess caterpillars? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's extremely appropriate. I'm s Don't put that in your ear, sir. Is this the Prince William caterpillar? Oh no, this is Saddleback caterpillar. That's a weird one. That's a weird one. That's a fucking weird one. Oh, the Black Prince Butterfly. Interesting. Well, there is not a just prince. Yeah, I gotta go into some unexplored area of the world and uh, find myself a caterpillar. Name it after myself. Look at that shiny boy. He's got a lot of flies on him. Why does he have a lot of flies on him? Like, they all have a lot of flies on them. Do they stink? Like, are flies attracted to them? He also looks really kind of... wet. I'm not certain I like this caterpillar. Yeah, I think I'm gonna throw this into the very much not a big fan. Oh! Oh, oh, oh my! Yeah, wet and spiky and stinky. Not my favorite thing. Oh, this is Gu Guadalupe. Yeah, wow. Oh my, hello, sir. Yeah, you look really gross. Oh! Huh! This is the Great Spangled Fritterary. I don't like Fritteraries. I must go out right out. <gasps> Tiny. 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 I'm a sucker for tiny things. Even though they grow up into those horrible these. Gonna say, not a big fan of those. Airy boy. Ah! 
Yeah, gonna go with not, not, not enjoying this one. That's interesting. Halloween caterpillar. Nokomi's fritillary. Well, if Nokomi can have a caterpillar named after them, then I should have a caterpillar named after me. Just not one of these. One of the cute ones, like the, it's the Japanese, I, all my Japanese study materials show up. Um, it's like the Emperor Caterpillar. on the Xbox. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! oh my god, I love these little guys. I love these little guys. Oh my god, favorite, favorite ever. And then they turn into these pretty boys. Oh my god. I love a stupid little fucking face. Oh my god. Look, if I if I was, you know, if they came up to me and they were like Prince, you have to take on a new identity. You have to do a new identity. I think I wouldn't be too upset if I was an Emperor Caterpillar. Yes! Very much just the, just, uh, um... This face. Hmm. Look, the resemblance is shocking. <laughs> yes, well, we won't find those here, because that's in Japan. Of course Japan gets the adorable caterpillar. And we get, oh, oh, um, I don't know how I feel about this one. He looks bumpy. Yeah, this one's fossilized. Oh, he hello. Not a fan. Oh, and then, and then we go to... So that was the White Admiral. Red Spotted Purple. Oh, okay. Um, you grow weird... Horns. Why is it head... Why is it head plant... Why is it face planted? What is it doing? <laughs> Oh, I guess that's about how big it- <laughs> Okay, um, we entered the weird boys space. These aren't party boys, these are weird boys. What are you doing? What are you doing? You look so weird. Oh, okay. Okay, that- you look kind of normal, but then you turn into this! Why? Oh! Oh! No! Oh! Sorry! Twitch! Oh god! Toss! 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 Um... I look like- that one looked like it had, uh, boobies on its back. So, quickly moving away from that. They kinda all look like they've got them on. Okay, that- interesting. <laughs> I! Not a fan of this one. I'm gonna say it. Not a fan of this little buddy. Not that he's bad. He's just not my favorite. Why? Why does his butt stick up? 
in the first place. You know, in the first place, why does his butt stick up? I know everyone's very into these Viceroy Caterpillars, because they look fucking weird. But I would love... I spoke too soon! <laughs> We're... Oh, oh, we, we came back to the top of the page. I was like, oh, what is that? Oh, now these are Admiral. Stop, please! He's got... His head even has growths on it. Very odd. Very odd. Alright, Arizona sister. No, that's worse! It's just covered in little bumpies. Ah! Okay! That's... less bad, but still pretty bad. Oh! Your face is a little... Your face I could get behind if you didn't look like that the rest of the way. Why? Why? Is your booty sticking up? Caterpillar! Caterpillar, put your booty down! Whoa! Okay, thank you! I, I like this one. Ruby Dagger Wing. Very cool. Oh! Empress Layla, these are called. Oh, you get the weird horns, too. You look like a slug. What happened to the cute caterpillars? Why are we in the weird- Oh! <laughs> right as I say, why are we in the weird ones? The cute one comes up. Oh! Oh! Whoa! No! 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 No. I like your pigtails, I guess. Chunky. Maybe we should have a genre called Spiky Boys. Common Menstra. Oh, yeah, he's a spiky boy. Gray Cracker. Harry Boy, ooh, you a little awkward. A little odd, a little odd. Do you think we can fill 30 more minutes with just looking at caterpillars? I think we can fill 30 more minutes just looking at caterpillars. <laughs> okay. Hi there, little buddy. You're a long boy. Look how long this boy is. There, there's probably enough caterpillar content for that. But uh, unfortunately, I do have to go to work tomorrow. Okay, more more fuzzy boys. I'm sorry, your head is red. My. More modeled and spiky boys. I think I think spiky boys is now its own genre. counts as spiky or hairy because the spikes have hair. He's also taken a nice big chunk out of that leaf. Again, the spikes have hair, so does he qualify as a spiky boy or a hairy boy? He might qualify as both, actually. We have double genre caterpillars. He could be double genre, too. Congrats, sir. Double genre. Oh! Oh, 
Oh my! I'm sorry, I don't, like... If a caterpillar is red and black, my brain goes to, like, that snake rhyme. I was like, red and black, stay back. And I'm like, you got it, boss. Staying away from things in the wild that are both red and black. And many of these spiky boys are red and black. Are you okay? Are you dead? Moving on. What? The spikes are blue. The spikes are blue. Huh. Some of these pictures are also deep fried. Yes, they do look cool. I will I will agree with you there. They look very cool. Are you caught in a spider web? Oh no. Or did you make that blood? Huh. Lots of spiky boys. Lots of spiky boys today are on this page. Many spikies. I would like to go back to toothpaste boys. Or even party boys. Or sweater boys. Oh, That's kind of cute. What are you? Texas Cre Texan Crescent. Oh, they turned into that. Great. <laughs> Every cute little one, I'm like constantly like, oh shit, it turns into what? <laughs> oh, okay. Texan Crescent. Oh yeah, they get then they get weird. Baltimore checker spot. Oh my. Can we like go back to the cool to like the cute looking ones? Cause these are all like like if I saw that in the wild, I would be like, uh-uh, not touching that. Which I mean probably is the whole point of them looking like this, is just so people don't mess with them. Oh, just one on the ground. Interesting. Oh. You okay? Why are you hanging there? Hey, climb? Climb around, look around, climb around, look around. Uh. Why? This whole page. I'm just gonna do like. I'm sorry. The common buckeye. You're the one with like the blue spots. The banded peacock? That's the worst picture I've ever. <laughs> what do you mean, question mark? <laughs> is it called the question mark? Or is it like they don't know what, what it is? What the hell? That's not a question mark. That's an exclamation point. <laughs> oh my. Very much oh my. But <laughs> yeah, the next one's called comma. Yeah. Well, actually, the next one is called the, yeah, the satyr comma. And then the hoary comma. <laughs> it's a comma that gets around a little too much. It's the hoary comma. Oh god, they're freaky. Oh, then we have Milbert's tortoiseshell. <laughs> oh, Milbert. That's a name that you just come up with when you're like DMing and they're like, who's the who what what's the name of the NPC we're talking to? And you're like, oh fuck, uh Milbert. Milbert. The morning cloak? Holy moly. Goodness gracious. That's a spiky boy. Holy crap! Intense spike. Yeah, no wonder it's called the morning cloak. You'll be fucking mourning for your foot after you step on that thing. And then the Red Admiral. Oh my. The Painted Lady. 
Ugh, that doesn't look like a painted lady. It looks like a, a shag carpet that someone dropped acid on and then it gained sentience. Oh, the West Coast lady. Again. Oh, the American lady. You have? Ah. Hayden's ringlet. That is about to pupate. And then the common ringlet. Wait, well, we're back in, um... Sweater guys and, um... The small wood nymph. Sweater guys and, uh... Toothpaste. Again! What is with caterpillars and sticking their ass out? <laughs> you can't mate! <laughs> You're not built for that! <laughs> the tufted tyriad. Is it, like, there's gotta be some, the two-line hook tip? Oh, I thought that said the two-line hookup. <laughs> Goodness gracious. The arched hook tip. It certainly is uh, arched. What is that? That's a mint green cactus. <laughs> I'm sorry. That looks like it's made of clay. That does not look like a real fucking... Caterpillar. Neither do these. God! Oh! <laughs> Someone went a little crazy with the spikes! Okay, you know what we're gonna do next? We're gonna take a break from looking at, uh... Yes, they do! We're gonna look at butterflies for a second. Yeah, yeah, the mint green one. We're gonna just look at butterflies. Stage. Adult. Species. Any. You know what? We're just gonna do any. We're gonna look at these for a second. The dull fire tip definitely matches up to its name. Is pretty dull. But the mangrove skipper is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it's time for some adult content. I mean, considering that these things uh, live to fuck and then die, I think that, yeah. Some of them don't even have mouths. And others, uh, if you want to keep them in captivity, you have to force feed them or else they will not eat. They're really pretty. These are actually pretty. Oh, That's cute. That's a cute little baby. The guava skipper? Oh. And the Uranus Skipper. Oh, Urania Skipper. Mercurial Skipper. Oh, it's, it's really fluffy. It's fluffy and putty. The Silver Spotted Skipper. Man. Imagine, like, taking all these pictures of butterflies. Oh, he got one to land on his finger? Lucky. Silver drop. A lot of these are kind of a little boring, so I'm gonna adjust myself in my chair. Holy, holy moly. My leg was like, hey, I'm falling asleep. All right, Manuel's skipper, pretty. 
Also, no idea what the hell it's standing on. But it's eating it. And I don't think I like that, so... Moving on. Long s Oh! That's kind of pretty! It's got that tail. White striped long tail, yeah. Watch out! There's a spider! The Zilpa long tail. Whoa! Gold spotted iguana. Or the emerald. Whoa, look at that green. That's really pretty. That's like a really pretty green. Or the tailed iguana. Oh, here we go. Modeled long tail. Or the eight spotted long tail. Does it really have eight spots? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, maybe. <laughs> Mexican long tail. Oh, it's a little one. Or the assign long tail. Mm. Oh, the long tailed skipper is really pretty. Turquoise long tail. Oh. They have, yeah. A lot of these are from uh, South America. <laughs> Good old Todd's. <laughs> yeah, Todd really wasn't into the into the butterflies. Whoa! The two bar flasher. <laughs> Whoa. Look how blue that is. Holy moly! With a frosted flasher. I don't want any kind of flasher near me, please. Like, no thank you. Oh, now here's the frosty flasher. Or the yellow-tipped flasher. Oh, you can't forget old Gilbert's flasher! <laughs> <laughs> Why are these named so oddly? Oh, Golden Band Skipper. Chisos Banded. Central American Banded. Spike Banded and Broad Banded. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The Hoary Edge. I'm sorry. The desert cloud wing. Ooh, pretty. And the coyote cloud wing. The halibus cloud wing and the drizzius cloud wing. Damn, forget the northern cloud wing. Goodness, freaking gracious. Or the northern cloudy wing. The confused cloudy wing! <laughs> Why did they decide this one was confused? <laughs> Why this one? Can you imagine that? If you're like, what did your parent- Oh, 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 butterfly sex. Oh, God. Um, we're not showing that on stream. I know I said adult content, but I meant just butterflies, not um butterfly sex. <laughs> Petroleo skipper. Fitzgartner skipper. Falcate Skipper, Acacia Skipper. Wow, there are so many freaking skippers. The Mimosa Skipper. Morning Glory. The Cryptic Skipper! <laughs> that's why the that's why the confused skipper is confused. <laughs> he ran into the cryptic skipper. <laughs> These are just freaking like Mega Man names. He does have real fuzzy wings. Winds Skipper. Oh my, these are both dead. Both of these are dead and mounted. Golden Head Scallop Wing. Oh my, wow, that really is golden. Hayhurst's Scallop Wing. 
any of these are very the oh the glassy winged skipper ah the texas powdered skipper but it's in yucatan mexico so The Dingy Mylon. Oh my god, can you imagine your name being Dingy? Oh, the Sickle Wing. The Cuban Sickle Wing is interesting. Oh, this one's kind of pretty too. The Orange Spotted Skipper. Ah, yes, it did skip Texas. Many Banded Skipper. The brown banded skipper, the squared bent skipper. That's a, that is an interesting wing shape, though. White centered bent skipper. Oh, the Caribbean dusky wing. Ooh, that's a pretty color. That is a wow. That is a really beautiful color. So the Zalefos dusky wing. The false dusky wing. It's not really a dusky wing. Don't let it fool you. Oh, the, another Caribbean dusky wing. The Florida dusky wing. The dreamy dusky wing. The sleepy dusky wing. Rocky Mountain dusky wing. Meriden Horace's dusky wing. <laughs> the mournful dusky wing. <sighs> Gasp. Model dusky wing. Oh my goodness. The funeral dusky wing. No. Wild indigo dusky wing. The column, oh, okay. That's, I think, more butterfly sex, so no thank you. Look, it's a grizzled skipper. He's been on the, on the, uh, he's been on the seas too long. Common checkered skipper. Lots of skippers. Still with the skippers. Oh my goodness. Yeah, just one day for retirement. Lavidian White Skipper. Alana White Skipper. The Common Sooty Wing. The Common Streaky Skipper. Wow, yeah, it's streaky. Uh, that, that, that tracks. Now we're into Sooty Wings. Oh, the Creon Skipper. Wow, look at that one bright red spot. <laughs> it's not the Streaky Flasher, no, it's not. <laughs> oh, we've got Skipperlings. So the, 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 the Skipper's trading little Skipperlings. That's why he's grizzled. Many spotted Skipperlings. Goodness gracious. I wonder if these are all moths. Greenback ruby eyes? Holy moly. Hi. Fantastic, Skipper. <laughs> the least Skipper. Oh, no. Don't be mean to him. <laughs> it sounds like one. If not, they should make that one. Maybe that's the Yu-Gi-Oh card that they'll make based on me. <laughs> the, the, the green back ruby eye. Lots of least skippers, southern skipperlings. Yep, these are all moths. Wow. And they're all, you know, moths. So they have moth colors. All moth colored, so they're all, you know, pretty, pretty plain. Let's 
Oh, these are also all Satchem. Uh, that's a good question. Oh, oh, I forgot. Difference between butterflies and moths. Uh, butterflies hold their wings up while moths hold their wings down. Oh, butterflies probably evolved from moths. Interesting. Okay. Um... Okay. Okay. Moths and butterflies. Oh, their scales are noise canceling? So that doesn't explain why they're different. That doesn't explain why they're different! You know what? They just have many minute butterf- my minute butterflies, minute differences. <laughs> oh my gosh, so many skippers! I get it, I just want to see the pretties. I'm sorry, that one's named the world- oh, it's having sex, god, why? Why are there so many pictures of butterfly and moth sex here tonight? The rare skipper. Wow. There's so many skippers. I would like. Maybe I should have put it. Oh, monk. Here's the monk. Just lots of monk. Oh my god, more skippers. Please. Please. Texas roadside skipper. Pepper and salt skipper. Lace winged roadside skipper. Oh my god. Orange edged roadside skipper. Yeah, what kind of. What, yeah, what kind of. Butterfly is that? Monk! That's the monk! Oh, the Brazilian skipper! <laughs> Careful, you don't say that differently. Um. Oh my god, the giant skipper. Oh, great. So now we've got skipper lits, and now we've got the giant skippers. Oh. <gasps> oh, that one's pretty. It's a big boy. It's a huge boy. Like, wow. And then, oh, pretty. That's the Claudius Parnassian. Rocky Mountain Parnassian. Oh, it's, a, it's dead, but um, it's still pretty. Pink Spotted Cattle Heart. Whoa. It's red and black, but I don't think this one's poisonous. I mean, are butterflies poisonous? I mean, I don't know. I'm not eating them. <gasps> Pipe fine swallowtail. That was a pretty color. Oh my god, please. I'm I'm begging you. I don't want to see the butterflies going at it. Mexican kite swallowtail. That's pretty. We'll do like we'll do five more pages and then we'll have to call it for the night. Ah, zebra swallowtail. I've caught so many of you in Animal Crossing. The white crested swallowtail. I don't I mean it's not like it's anything explicit that it's not like Twitch is gonna look at me and go banned. It's it's butterflies. It's butterflies, and you wouldn't know if you didn't know that butterflies put their butts together to have sex. You wouldn't know that. 
It's not explicit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can I can I please filter out the butterfly sex? Old world swallowtail. Ah, short-tailed swallowtail. Black swallowtail. Ozark swallowtail. God, please, enough, enough. Anise swallowtail. Indra. Oh my god. Lime? Okay, that's new. The lime swallowtail. The Canadian tiger swallowtail. And the Appalachian tiger swallowtail. Eastern tiger swallowtail. The Western tiger swallowtail. I mean, I also, you know, butterflies live to basically propagate and die, so... If if they're not eating, they're fucking, so... <laughs> the two-tailed swallowtail. And the spice brush swallowtail. That's the one that looked look like uh, it had eyes on the top of its head. Oh god, again. Um, magnificent swallowtail. Giant swallowtail. So many swallowtails. I mean, they're pretty. They're definitely pretty. Bahaman swallowtail. Androgeous swallowtail. Caribbean swallowtail. God bless it. His Hispanoli Hispanolian mimic white. That's the 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 face freaks me out, but the wings are pretty. Tiger mimic white. Oh, now we're in the little white butterflies. Stella orange tip. Falset. Falsate orange tip. Desert marble. Northern marble. Pine white. So many. So many butterflies. Darkened white, mountain white, arctic white. God, stop it. Stop it! <laughs> stop it! Oh my god! No, no, no! This whole page! <laughs> we want a couple more, so maybe, maybe we won't keep running into this. Maybe we can look at some other ones. Great southern white. The great white. Lysite sulfur. Clouded sulfur. <laughs> they help these white butterflies do. Orange sulfur. Western sulfur. Yeah, you know what? Sure, show me all the dead ones. The pink edged sulfur. That's pretty. The southern dog face. Oh my gosh, their wings look like leaves. Their wings are just leaves. Look how well they blend in. They just look like a leaf. Cloudless sulfur. Pink spot, satira, hard yellow. All these leaves. All these leaves. All right. Tailed orange, tailed yellows, little yellows, sleepy orange, the dainty sulfur. Yeah. <laughs> I just. You. Harvester. Tailed copper, American copper. Oh, the blue copper! <gasps> so pretty! So pretty! Unfortunately, it's two hours! It's been two hours! We've looked at caterpillars and butterflies for two hours. <laughs> I'm out. 
Oh, it, it's blue copper, I believe. Yes, yeah, the blue copper. But I don't know how it can be both blue and copper at the same time. Maybe copper's just the... What they call them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. The colors aren't clear. <laughs> oh, oh, bronze. Oh, one's... Oh, yeah, the bronze copper. Well, they've, they've got bronze and copper in them. Yeah, I would call that bronze and copper. Ugh. Got my stretches in. But... Unfortunately, we have reached the end of our time for tonight. Thank you so much for being here, Zetetico, with me. Yep, big stretches. Thank you for being here with me as I looked at caterpillars, enjoyed caterpillars, and enjoyed some butterflies and some moths, too. Ugh. Let's pop over here. So, I do work tomorrow, but... But, uh, I should be back home in time to stream. So... Yeah, lots of cat pillars! Um... I should be- I should be back in time to stream to tomorrow night. Uh, we'll probably play more Variable Barricade. Um... Or FTL, we'll see how I'm feeling. Um, playing the silly games, playing the silly stuff is uh, very helpful for when I'm feeling stressed. So yeah, that is it for tonight. I will see you all tomorrow. And yeah, you know the usual song and dance if you're not following all socials. I appreciate it. Um... My TikTok glitch got cleared up, so that's good. Finally. Finally. <laughs> um, so that's all back up and running. And, uh, yeah, that's really it. Uh, that's, the, uh, that's all the announcements I got. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful meowning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is for you. Thank you all so, 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 so much for joining me. Yeah, I'm about to go become a cat burrito. <laughs> Alright, without any further ado, bye-bye!